So I've been asked to give a instruction manual on how to assemble one of the auto loaders, but I probably thought one of the best parts is to um, give you a lowdown specifics because it should be relatively straightforward to put together. So what we're trying to achieve to build is, here's what I made earlier, one of these auto loaders. And in true Blue Peter fashion, here's one I took apart earlier. Um, so the two springs that are in the kit sit nice under there, and your barrel goes in the top hole here. If you find that doesn't go in nicely, <coughs> you might just blast down the hole with a lighter to soften the plastic and feed it in. It might just be some spurs off your printing that's caused that issue. Something down a bit. Goes with the tooth to the back. To your micro switch here. And the turret goes on top of that. And the micro switch goes into the back of that. Make sure the holes line up nicely. I think you use your long screws to affix the um, cap piece with these long screws. Other bits that are important to remember is that. When you rebuild the drive gear here, remember to have the top plate. Now this is the five by three mil by 15 mil long piece of tubing. That's very important. If you don't have that on, you'll end up with BBs getting stuck in here and they'll chomp into your gear, drive gear and cause your problems. So that goes on like that. And the agitator, matches the Vs on there. And that mixes your BBs as it goes round and round to make sure you don't get stacking of BBs and then stopping feeding. That should get you to a constructed um, loader. For the wiring loom at the back, hopefully that should give you enough information how to wire it up. 